Hello and welcome to Take Time. I'm your host, Patrick Marlette, and let's talk about the channel. So as you guys can already tell in the about section describing this show, it is a watch channel for enthusiasts by enthusiasts. I love incorporating your thoughts and ideas and your opinions into what I do. Of course, we are gonna go over the winner for our May Gleam giveaway on the Watch Hipster roll bag, but that is gonna be at the end of this update video. Now that winner should have received an email from myself and the Watch Hipster on receiving your new roll bag. If you haven't received that email yet, feel free to check your spam or junk mail. It might've got shuffled in there. Now gang, there is actually no giveaway for the month of June, at least here on the channel. I'm reformatting how we do giveaways in the future and we're gonna test out doing giveaways over on Instagram. I am very excited for the June giveaway. If you haven't subscribed to the Instagram, I'll highly encourage you to do so as that is how you get one entry in for the watch I'll be featuring on that giveaway. So if you are not on that platform, go ahead and visit at Take Time Pat to be a member of the Instagram community. And if you wanna share pictures of any of your watches with me, feel free to hashtag Take Time Pat, or you can just tag me in the post as well. A lot of people do that. All right, enough of that. I do want to talk about YouTube content pressing forward. Guys, you should expect a special 5K subscriber video to come out. If it hasn't released yet, that's a shame. I was really expecting us to hit 5K before that mark, that being this video. But I might as well explain what it is now. I'm gonna be providing you guys with sketches. Now, some of you might already know this. I don't know why you would, unless you saw me in a show or theatrical performance, but I went to school for the performing arts. I really love entertaining people. That's why I run this channel and I wanna provide some of my amazing talent to sketches, short comedic sketches that are watch centric on this show. Obviously, I don't know how often or regularly I can do this. I'd like to do at least one a month, but they are very labor intensive. Scripting, filming, editing, all done on my part. And this first sketch being performed solely by me. In the future, I am going to get a variety of actors to perform out various roles in watch-centric sketches here on the channel. And of course, I'd love to up the production value moving forward on those as well. I think it's important we don't take ourselves too seriously, and these sketches are gonna be a great way to celebrate our love of watches as watch enthusiasts. Also, I'm getting underway to produce a new segment for the channel that I'm actually filming in the next few hours. I'm so underprepared for it, but I am very excited to begin. This new segment is called Cocktail Time. Cocktail Time is going to be a discussion-based segment where I play the host to a variety of guests that work within the watch industry. In the first half of Cocktail Time, I will be crafting a cocktail for the featured guests based off of their brand or personality. And in the second half, we just talk watches. But more than that, I wanna discuss growing trends in the watch industry. I wanna to get to know more about the guests that are in. I wanna talk more about their brands and I wanna talk more about them and life in general. My first guest is a good friend and just an extremely awesome watch person who's an amazing photographer. So of course, we're gonna be talking a little bit about his photography. We're also gonna be talking a little bit about his brand. So be on the lookout for that first episode of Cocktail Time. It should be airing this month. Now, before that second even airs, I'd like to give a special thanks to Neil Carpenter, who's letting me use his shop in Brooklyn to film the Cocktail Time series. Neil Carpenter owns and operates Carpenter Watches, and his store, the Brooklyn Watch Shop, is based over in Brooklyn, New York. Go figure. If you haven't visited the store yet, I'll highly encourage you to do so. There is a link in the description to his website and store. He features his own watches there, watch repairs. He also sells accessories and vintage watches. So if watches are your thing, it's a great place to go. Whew, yeah, a lot is lined up for the show. I am losing my mind with review items. You can't see this, but there are just a bunch of things on this table in front of me that I haven't gone to, need to get to, need to edit. Um, but I'm very excited with all the support I've been receiving from all these various brands. So if you are a brand that has supported the show and you're watching now, thank you so much. And most importantly, thank you guys for raising so much support for this show. We've done a lot in a relatively small amount of time. It's been a little over half a year and I am very excited with where this channel is going. I, of course, want to keep evolving it and doing more with the content here. And it's all thanks to your help and support that I continue doing so. So thank you guys so much for supporting the channel.
Now gang, I'm gonna do a small plug for this now because it is something I'm hoping will take this channel off the ground and allow me to produce more and more content for you guys on a more regular basis. Note, this is completely voluntary. I know I'm gonna get a bunch of people smashing me in the comments section, but if you all wanna directly support the channel, you can do so by visiting my Patreon at Take Time with Patrick Marlette. The link has always been in the show notes of these videos, so to all of the early supporters that have been helping me out with 14 to $20 a month, every month since the beginning. Thank you so much. It really, really means a lot. You know, it hasn't provided me enough to take a day off of work, but it has provided me enough to buy some coffee over at Parrot Coffee and make sure that I can stay up to edit this workout. So thank you guys. Every individual brand that comes to me, I offer them free reviews here on the channel. Um, in return, I get to be as candid as I want when it comes to reviewing their items, and I much prefer that. I think it's most fair for the brands because they're getting honest feedback from you guys in the comments section and myself, and it's most fair, most importantly, for the consumers who are looking to purchase a new watch. Now you might have noticed I don't really do list on this channel either. I don't think best of categories, best under 5,000, 1,500 really work because more oftentimes than not, people don't have real world experiences with the items they're talking about. So feeding that information to you isn't very helpful. Talking about actual products in hand, I think firsthand experience is super helpful. That's why over on the Patreon, one third of every dollar is going to go towards buying product for this show. That is one third of every dollar that I receive from your support. So let's pretend I get 750 in a month before Patreon zaps 20% off the top of that. $250 is gonna be set aside to buy products that you, the Patreon supporter, request. As I'd rather be talking about watches we all wanna see, I'm going to be putting up polls and posts regarding different watches we can buy within different price ranges that you all might wanna see reviewed in our signature two-part review segment here on the show. So let's say within that first month, we reach our goal and make $750. That leaves us with 250 to purchase whatever we want. I run a poll and there's an Orient Bambino seventh version that everyone wants to see. We'll purchase that. Any excess amount of dollars from that first purchase will carry over into the next month so that we can put that towards another purchase for the show. Month two, I feature said Orient Bambino in a two-part review with an unboxing first impression and an in-depth review. And in month three, that Orient Bambino is featured on the channel as a giveaway item for all YouTube subscribers. I cannot legally only provide that watch for giveaway for Patreon supporters. Although I'd prefer that no purchase is necessary for any of these future giveaways. And again, they have to be accessible for the YouTube channel. Now the excess money I receive on Patreon is gonna to go towards shipping that watch to its new owner. And of course, helping me produce more content for the channel, whether it's paying actors that are gonna work in a sketch for me, because I'd rather pay the actors that are working for me. Paying for different venues for future meetups. I'd like to talk more about that in the future, but if we have more support, it would be really awesome for everyone to get together and talk watches. And more importantly, if you are a Patreon subscriber, not only do you get the guide which way the discussions go so far as watches we receive are concerned, you'll also have influence on the type of sketches we do. Now, of course, I have a myriad of ideas in regards to sketches, but I will put up polls on the Patreon that you guys can come to an agreement on on what you'd like to see next. And of course, if you have your own ideas for something that you think would be funny, dramatic, whatever it is, I'd love to take those and place those on polls too. Take Time truly is a channel for watch enthusiasts by watch enthusiasts, and I think this is the best way to make it so. Again, you don't need to be a Patreon supporter for me to continue producing content for the show. I love doing this show and I love entertaining. This has been one of the most meaningful projects I've ever involved myself in. So, you know, with, with or without the sport, I'm gonna do it anyways. But guys, if you want to donate a dollar, it's just a dollar every month to be a much larger part of this program, I would really appreciate it. And with that, I need to start getting ready for cocktail time, preparing the topics for discussion, and of course, getting footage from the shoot. Um, oh my gosh, this is gonna be such a crazy day. And if the sketch has aired yet, you watched it, you enjoyed it. If it hasn't aired yet, be on the lookout for that. I'd love your feedback on that piece. You can provide it here. You can obviously provide it in the comment section for that video. But again, I wanna do more of that as well. <laughs> here I am getting ready to walk off into the sunset and I nearly forget to talk about the May giveaway winner. 
the one lucky recipient of the Watch Hipster travel bag for the month of May. Your name is on the screen now. Yeah, it's happening. That's you. Now, again, if you didn't receive an email from me or the Watch Hipster himself, feel free to check your junk mail and or trash or spam. I don't know how it wound up there, but you're certainly a winner in my eyes. Congratulations and thank you for all the entrants who applied to this most recent giveaway. Again, if you're interested in giveaways, the next one will be featured over on my Instagram page. And that's it. Thank you for watching Take Time. Be on the lookout for more reviews, interviews, vlogs. I would love to do more vlogs, sketches, and discussions via cocktail time. Again, my name is Patrick Marlette, and thank you for the time.